greetings hello everyone welcome back to the channel in this video i will show you how to create a table in microsoft fabric lakehouse step by step in simple language let's say you have an excel file with your business sales data we are going to upload that into microsoft fabric and turn it into a proper table Microsoft Fabric is a tool that helps you store and organize your data in the cloud. Let's use a real life example. Let's say or imagine you are running a small shop. Every day you record what you sell in a spreadsheet. Here a sample file we use today. We want to upload this file into Microsoft Fabric and turn it into a table. Let's do it together. Step 1. You need to log in to Microsoft Fabric. If you don't have an account, then you can get a free trial at fabric.microsoft.com. Now, once you are in, go to Workspaces, click New Workspace and name your workspace as Let's assume sales workspace. Sales workspace. And this name is available. Go to advanced and select trial and apply. That's it. You have created your own data workspace. Next, let's create a lake house. Go to new item. Select lake house and give name as my sales lake house. Create. Now we will upload your spreadsheet to this lake house. Go to files, upload, upload files, go to browse center and then in documents select sales data, open and then you need to upload it. And once it is uploaded, it will reflect here. And then if it is not reflecting, then you can refresh this page. That's it. Now your file is in Microsoft Fabric. Now let's turn your file into a real table so that it is easier to search, filter and analyze. Now you can right click, uploaded file. Go to load to tables and go to new table and here you can name this table as sales table. Let's name it as sales table and then separator if you want you can give and then load. Once it is loaded, you will see rows and columns just like Excel file, but it is more powerful than Excel. Here if you see, you can see all your columns here. Make sure that data types are in correct format. And then you can go to your lake house here or workspace here go to your SQL analytics point you can query your data to run comments which gives you questions like what products made the most money and which region sold the most items and also how many laptops did I sell in last month for that You can choose your new SQL query and then here type select star from sales table and then you can run this and it gives you the complete data in this table. You can see the data if you want to select items like for example, select star from 
or you can use product and you can sum that price or revenue sum of revenue as total revenue and from sales table if you want to group by use group by product and you can order by total revenue in descending order and then select this complete query run so now it will select only that product and sum of revenue as total revenue from sales table and it is grouped by product and order by total revenue in descending order if you see you can see that everything in descending order this tells you which product earned you the most money and then you can choose another query let's say select region comma sum of revenue as regional sales let's name it regional sales from sales table and then group by region and now you can select this and run it this query breaks down total sales by region wise now that your data is in a table you can build charts and dashboards and connect to power bi and combine more files also you can schedule automatic updates and share it with your team and the best part it all happens in one place in online and securely and that's it you just created your first table in microsoft fabric lakehouse if you want to see you can see your table here you uploaded a real life file turned it into a table and ran your first data queries if this video helpful please give the video a thumbs up subscribe for more simple tech tutorials and drop a comment